All right then, we're coming back to a spot that we came the other day that did an amazing fur. And we are coming to try something that she said we had to try. Hello, Sin Chao. We have come for Boho. Boho. You have? Okay. <laughs> Should we get two or one? Can we get mod ban mi bo kho and mod fe? Okay, fe bo thai. Okay, super. Okay, come on. Right, so we'll sit down. Not gonna film too much of this, but should we get two? Let's get two. Let's get high. Okay. So yeah, this we came in the day had a fur and the lady was amazing and she kept showing us the bo kho. So we're trying it because she said it's delicious and it looks so good when she showed us this dish. Honestly, you'll see, you'll see when it comes, we'll show you what it is. We only vaguely know what it is, but yeah. This, this first shop, if you are in, where are we? Tanfu area of Saigon. It's really good. So yeah. Wow. This looks so good. I know, okay, okay, don't worry, don't worry. She's lovely, she's dead, but I really appreciate that she's given her a job. Just a moment of appreci appreciativity, even though that's not even a word, but it's really nice because they're all lovely ladies in it. She could have hired anyone who was in me. I know, but she's, yeah, appreciate that. This looks so good. It smells so good. Wow. Oh my, mamma mia. Great, then our dish has arrived. Now this is the Bo Ho, which is a fiery Southern Vietnamese beef stew. Supposedly spicy. Now this, honestly, looks unbelievable. So we've got the stew, we've got two huge banh mi baguettes. I've got again our side sauce that we're making here, which I'll show you after when we give the fur a quick mention because we can't not mention that fur. Now look in here. This smells beautiful. We've got huge chunks of beef. We've got onion, spring onions. We've got a lot of black pepper on the top. And it just looks well good. It looks so rich. It looks like exactly what you want to dip that bread into, doesn't it? Wow. That looks fantastic. I can't believe it. So, we've got to just try that straight out, haven't we? Let's see what it tastes like. It looks oily, it looks, looks good. It's hot. Wow. Oh wow, that's so good. Oh, that's well good. It's so rich. Oh wow. It's like a super like rich beefy taste. Like it, It's heavy. Spring, spring onions. The onion also lightens it up. My brain had a meltdown, man. That's well good. So I'll try the beef in a second, but let's just dip some of the bread in. Because that's what this was made for, isn't it? Wow. Mm -hmm. Obviously, bun me. Super crispy bread but the inside is just perfectly fluffy and let me tell you that when you dip that in it's like the perfect carrier for this soup mm. oh, so good and then we've also got this bloody basket of herbs to throw in there as well as the fur like Look at this, there's so much. I'll just throw a few, a few of these in. Bit of a selection. But all kinds of different stuff. Half the stuff, obviously, we don't even know what it is. But it's all delicious. Let's throw loads of herbs in there. You can never have too much herbage. Oh, and now all the herbs are blown out of my dish. So you're gonna love this, mate. We're gonna have to try some of this beef in here. Let me fish some out. I mean, it's not gonna be hard to fish some out, is it? Because there's so much in there. Like, they are giant pieces of beef. Holy moly. Let's get a small bit. Let's try and munch on this bit here. Mm -hmm. 
Oh my goodness me. That is beautiful. Oh my. That beef is in that is, I don't I, how can I even describe the softness? You don't even need to chew it. Person with bloody no teeth could eat this. So soft. Mm. It's amazing. Well, he's now telling someone, someone else to make a YouTube video. Oh, it's amazing. So good. Okay, we will tell her after, yeah. Okay, thank you so much. Come on, come on. It's so good we came back again. After everywhere, we come back here. Me too. Oh, really? Yeah. yeah. So, do you get fur or do you get bubble? Fur? Yeah. Fur, fur. Yeah. England. Yeah. Yeah. Are you from Saigon? Uh, no, I'm not. Where about? I'm from Olympia. Where are you from? Yeah, I'm from North Japan. What, what, what city? Oh, uh, Hanoi. Hanoi, you're from Hanoi. Yeah. Hanoi, Hanoi. Do yeah. you live here? No, I live here. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So good. <laughs> enjoy, enjoy, enjoy. <laughs> right, I don't know if you're meant to do this, but I'm going to try some of this beef in our little side dip. I don't know if that's a done thing, but we'll do it anyway. This beef, it's hard to eat because it's so big. Let's try and get it. Oh, I'm spilling it everywhere. Let's try and get a smaller bit. Oh, it's that soft. My chopsticks can cut it. Wow, let's try that then. Let's get some of the fresh chilli, some of the fresh whole piece of garlic. Now look at that. And these are hot. Let me tell you, these fresh chillies are hot. Let's get some of the herbage. Well, that's hard to get in my mouth, isn't it? Wow, the herbs take it to like a whole new level. This is one of the favourite meals I've had in Vietnam again. In my life. What keeps happening? In my life, in my life. Who's that good? Wow. It's mind blowing, mind blowingly good. Let's give it one last dip. Look at how red this is. Look at it staining the bread like. Holy whack-a-mole. Can't dip it too long, it gets too soggy. <laughs> Wow. Now let's get some of these fresh chilies. The garlic again. I'm a very, very happy man. That is absolutely fantastic. The beef is just crazy. Super fatty, super rich, you know, we got, oh, it's amazing. Right, enough talking. There we go. Boho. A dish that you must try. Make sure you don't miss this one. And like I said, I've got to give a quick shout out to this fur because this shop is seriously so good. Like the ante is lovely and the food, like this fur is, I look at the meat in there. We're in the biggest city in the country. We could eat anywhere we want. We've chosen to come back here. Yeah, we've come back twice. Years that we've spent here, which is just a testament to how good it is. So look at this beef. Look at the fat striations on there. So what we'll do is give this a big dip into our little sauce we've made. And I'm having an absolute struggle here. There we go. Let's give it a big dip. All right, cheers. It's so good. Honestly, it's amazing. Right. This fur is so good. Portion size is gigantic as well. Let's just remind myself of how good the noodles are as well. Oh yeah. Extremely soft. It's mind-blowing. That beef, believe me, 
It's going to change your life, that. That beef, dipping it in that sauce. Ooh. I've got loads of herbage in there, but I want to try the, the beef. Oh my god. Check that out. It literally just melts. It melts in your mouth. And it's super heavy. But because you put so many herbs in it, it just makes it oh, The balance is like, it's just there. Everything in this country is just balanced. Like, look at how good this beef looks. I mean, I put my camera down, but I can't not keep picking it up because it just looks so like that is good beef. Like, and it's it's not super thin. Like, you get in a huge portion. There's so much meat in this when you get it served. Like, and noodles as well. It's like a massive bowl of fur four. I think it's like. 45k, if I remember correct, so this is a meal. Okay, Damon, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. I see the owner, she asked for the YouTube channel. Okay, I will do it, I will do it, yeah. Oh, sorry, sir. Thank you. How long will you stay here? We're just in Saigon for three days. We leave tomorrow night. We are going to Quignon. Quignon, Quignon. Is it nice? Yes. Yeah, 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 to see. We're gonna go to uh, like Hanoi or Haiphong too later. We have been to Hanoi and Haiphong a few months ago. Yeah. Yes, yes. We like the North, but I like Haiphong is one of my favorite cities. Yeah. Yes. Actually, like my family from Haiphong. Oh wow. Yes, and, and then we moved to Hanoi. Oh. oh cool. Then my wife born in Hanoi. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah. In Haiphong, the food is so good. Yeah. Yes. What is it? Ba Banda Kwa. Banda Kwa, yeah. yeah. Banda Kwa, I thought. You can't go wrong with that. Yeah. Just, really good, yes. Yeah. Really so, you go to Okay. Okay. So, she said, like, she told me, like, last time we went here and, uh, you know, she wanted to ask for the channel. Yes. But she don't know how to do it. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> we, we had to come back. We could not come back. Not, not come back. It's so good. <laughs> okay, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Okay. Absolute legend. He just came in. He's eating his bowl of fur in about three seconds. <laughs> Honestly. <laughs> That's testament to how good it is. You're all looking at the channel now. They're, they're lovely, aren't they? They better be subscribing. That's so funny. Ah, they're checking it out. <laughs> right, we need to finish this food now. <coughs> so good, so good, honestly. Finished the entire balls, it's so good. Let's see how much there is. I think we, well, we know like the first 45 on there. Bojo, bojo, so good. Sat now on, sat now on. Yes, very good, lad. Like. Yeah, thank you. Well, good. Chin mui. Chin mui. Okay, okay, okay. Chin mui. Is that 90? 95. 95. Oh no, you can keep. It's okay. For, for you, you ah, can keep. You. Okay. <laughs> okay. Come on, come on. Okay, okay. It was so good. Okay, goodbye. Goodbye. Amazing little spot. Okay. Goodbye. She's absolutely lovely. Absolutely lovely. They're all lovely now. They're all together. And I say, while we're sitting there, the guy came up and pulled like in on his bike onto the curb, and he fell into the road. Like the bike fell on top of him. It was traumatic. Maybe I'll have to go and get him. Legends. Really funny blokes, honestly. And he got straight back up off his bike, straight in there, having a ball of fur just instantly. He got crushed by his bike and he's having a fur. Okay, let's go. That was so good. Vietnamese karaoke. Right, all that food came to 95,000 dong. Cracking price for such good food. Like, filling, rich, amazing food. We've had some seriously good Cool food today, like you, 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 yeah. some unique food, some more lovely people, some more of the things we can find on the streets of Saigon. The pharmacy, the chemist is selling durian. Why? I tell you what, it's true. What Nelson taught us, it's good for your health. It's good for you. Like Nelson said, it's very good for your health. It's like a natural health remedy. That's so funny, isn't it? That they just sell durian in the Vietnamese pharmacy. Good for your health, I guess. 
National Medicine. Come on. That's so funny. The ring looks really good as well, isn't it? We just asked, it's 120,000 dong a kilo, I think. Unless you're saying for one doing, I don't know. Now this spot here we walked past the other day and the ladies were so nice, they like nearly near enough grabbed us in. So when we walk past here, there's no way they are not gonna let us come in and get a drink. They've seen us, it's all over. We're gonna have to get some We did our usual, we just said we'll come back tomorrow, we just said name I. We tell everyone we'll come back tomorrow and then, because we can't lie to people, we have to come back. So it's just a little juice shop and the ladies working here are really nice though. Yakult series. Yeah, they've got all kinds of stuff. A full Yakult series of what is it? Yakult mixed with maybe juice, maybe like fruit. I don't know. And then we've also got tea, milk teas, and I don't know what that is. Some other sort of tea. Cheese, cream cheese. Ah, okay. What are you in the booth? What is best? What What should we get? What should we get? What is your favourite? For you. For you. No cafe, uh, maybe like a uh, yakul cha. What? What oh, is wait, best? Wait, wait, okay, okay. Let's we'll see what we're. Like, do you have like dough? Yakul dough. Yakul. Yakul Yo. dough. Strawberry. Oh. oh, it's not peach. 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 Ah, uh, yakul peach. Yeah. Yes, yakul peach, please. One. One, yes. yes. Okay. What else? That's it. Just that. Okay. I have cafe. We have cafe moi. What is inside is just, is it just yakul and peach? Yakul, peach, and then what else? Is it tea? Cha? No. Yes. Tea? Oh, okay. It's really nice, though. The ladies in here are really nice. First day we walked past, shirts in the smiles to give us, and they need enough grab us in. So this is yakul. Oh, wow, we've got an audience here. <laughs> Audience at the traffic lights. Yes, everywhere we've been, it's like, oh, we really eat in there because of the people. Yeah, pretty much. Like, literally. So this looks so good, doesn't it? This is, I think she said yakult, peach. Tea. Is, it, is it tea as well? Wow, this is quite intimidating now because the traffic's just like building and building. And there's more and more people just like staring at us, drinking this tea. So we've actually got a proper piece of peach in there as well. Oh, my camera's gonna die in a second. I better try this quick. Let's try it. As good as I expected. So good, like. It's huge. I think it's a 700 mil one. They do 500 and 700 mil. It might, I think it's like 20k. It tastes like peach, so yakul, and tea. It, it tastes like what it is, believe it or not. Oh my gosh, that is like the most refreshing drink I've had. It's really good. I feel like all we've done since we got to Vietnam this time, just sit at the side of the road, eating or drinking, and just chatting shit to people. And here we are again, people watching. I've got to say, does anyone else ever like, get motion sickness or go home after doing this all day? And when they get inside, feel sick and like the world's spinning. I think it's because we sit here for that long, just watching like bikes go past. Did it, uh, it makes us feel like that. Yeah. Why is everyone so nice? This lady's got a really nice blue and white bike. That is a nice bike. Like every single person goes by waves at us. Which is lovely. Deserves another shout out. It's really good this. We've just discovered there's actually in the very bottom, or oh, you can't really see, like pieces of peach that when you're drinking it like come up through the straw. Mm. Super sweet. Super delicious that. And a hot day. But this is so good. If you're actually driving past, you can literally just pull up on your motorbike here. The lady will come out with the menu, wherever the menu is. She's got like a bloody massive piece of wood that's the menu. And then you can order here and then drive off. Like you don't even have to get off your bike. It's like a drive through. How good's that? And we were just speaking to her and she says, I think we got, this is just her shop. I think she said there's only one of these. Could be wrong, but I think that's what she said. And the drinks are really good. And the people are super lovely. Can't go wrong. And look, this is the best place to sit ever, isn't it? How good is it? I mean, apart from the bloody pollution. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe the pollution, yeah, the traffic lights and the uh, vertigo I'm getting. Yeah. From Berlin. Yeah. Oh, oh, it's good. Oh, so we're getting shown the Facebook promo video for the shop. It's family business. Promotion video. 
good video. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> okay, good night. We approve of the promo video. So this is the business. Same room. What is it called? Check the business out. Chim, chim cha. I'm not going to read that out actually. I'm just going to show you the sign. This is the name. This, this is the name. Do you want to read it out for everyone? Cha cha sua. That's what you need to go. Cha sua dai lon. Okay. <laughs> and these are the lovely owners. Absolutely lovely ladies. Oh, so that's the name. Oh, okay. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Hai Lam. Hai Lam Nin. Oh, take a photo now. Tomorrow. Oh, tomorrow. Okay, okay, okay. In Vietnam, Japan. Oh, okay, sorry. Japan. Japan. I don't know, but I'm guessing it's Japan. Okay. Let's take one now as well, on here. I'm going to lie. Yeah. Okay. 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 She looks, she looks very young. Yeah. Yeah. No, 45. 47. 47. No. She looks very young. 47. She looks, she looks younger than 30. Yeah. That's crazy. Yeah. <laughs> like, like. Yeah. Con, con là 20. Yeah. Con Wow. <laughs> you look so amazing. Yeah. Okay. Wow. That's crazy, isn't it? Yeah, I know. Okay. It's 25. 25, perfect. 25 for that drink. It was massive as well. Good value. With fresh fruit in. So we'll come back, yeah. They've got all kinds of stuff, all different fruits, haven't they? That was really good. I can't believe 47. I know. 47. What the hell? I look older than 24. They can't be having that. Vietnamese people age so well, ridiculously well. Okay, come on. Oh, a new one. Crispy no. Okay. See you tomorrow. Okay. See you tomorrow. Okay. We'll come back. Okay. Lovely to meet you. Come on. Amazing. Wow, the traffic. The traffic. Look, everyone's going past with like 17 people to a bike. Hello.